everyone and welcome back to my channel. Recently Disney released a Little Mermaid featurette which contains some new footage that I'm going to break down. The first new shot features Ariel swimming in the Karini Sea that she rules over. After this we see Ariel swimming in a darker part of the ocean. I presume this is on her way to her grotto containing her collection. The next new shot features Ariel during the under the sea sequence with a ton of coloured sea creatures. Director Rob Marshall said that Under the Sea was the most complicated musical number he's ever done and he used reference footage choreographed by African-American modern dance troupe the Alvin Ailey American Dance Theatre Company. After this we see Ariel above the ocean's surface at night. She is looking up at the fireworks coming from the ship. The next new sequence features some neon jellyfish and it kind of reminds me of Finding Nemo. There are also these blue creatures which look like the ones from Avatar. Ariel is then seen holding on to a purple jellyfish tentacle swimming upwards. She then slides down a rock tunnel away from the creatures and Hallie looks adorable here. After this Ariel is seen on land with Prince Eric opening a scroll which I think is a map. The two are likely bonding over how much they want to explore the world. It also reminds me of the library scene in the live action Beauty and the Beast. The next new shot is Ariel singing Part of Your World which I saw at the D23 Expo and of course Hallie sounds amazing. After this Hallie is seen swimming among dolphins and I am super jealous because I love dolphins. Then we see another Part of Your World sequence this time during the line Love to Explore That Shore Up Above. She is gesturing upwards just like in the original movie. The next new shot is of Ariel entering Ursula's lair on a slightly wider angle than we saw in the teaser, followed by a close up of Ursula where she tells Ariel that she has been watching her for a long time. Her costume includes some black spikes with neon blue on the ends. Ariel is in Ursula's tentacles and one of them is used to move Ariel's head to look at Ursula and she looks pretty scared. After that Ursula is seen spinning in my favourite shot in this video. Following this Ursula appears to be casting a spell by putting some pink coral into a cauldron which already has some orange magic in it. Ursula then starts shimmying downwards and I presume this is part of Poor Unfortunate Souls. The next section is Ursula and Ariel having a conversation. Ursula says we got a deal and Ariel gives her a conflicted look. Ursula seeing that she is hesitating says I mean I just gave you the premium package kid and in this angle you can really see how much space Ursula takes up with her large tentacles. There is then a shot of Ariel still looking concerned. After this Ursula is seen saying true yes during Poor Unfortunate Souls. This sequence was also seen in the Entertainment Weekly article. She pops up from under her tentacles and then leans forward. The next new sequence is during Kiss the Girl while Ariel and Eric are in a boat. The lake is glowing blue and fish are squirting up water to add to the romantic mood. There is a tiny new part of Ariel looking towards the surface after hearing fireworks with Flounder. We have seen a slightly different version of this in the trailer. After this we see a slightly wider shot of a mermaid from previous footage. I am now convinced that this character is Karina, one of Ariel's sisters. You can also see Indira here who is played by Simone Ashley. They both are followed by various sea creatures matching their colour palette. Next there is another under the sea shot. It involves the same characters from the trailer. The red seaweed like creatures and the dancing fish with large fins. Ariel seems to be beckoning them towards her as they dance around her. After this there is another part of your world shot with Ariel swimming upwards. In the background you can see some bottles from her collection. Ariel is then seen swimming upwards towards the surface. This is the shot preceding the water mirror shot seen previously. After this there is a wider shot of Ariel singing the part of your world reprise on the rock. Here you can see her full tail and none of this is CGI as a real tail was used while they were shooting in Italy. Then there is an above shot of under the sea with Ariel sitting on a pink shell with sea creatures forming a circular pattern around her. Next Ariel is seen taking the reins of a horse drawn carriage. She is so happy but Eric is a little concerned by her reckless driving. The second last shot is Ariel with Sebastian. I feel that this may be the beginning of Under the Sea with him telling her that the human world is a mess. The final shot is Eric and Ariel about to kiss just as the sun is about to set on the third day. Sadly as in the animated film they will miss the deadline. A 
Additionally, I just want to quickly add that the featurette includes some clips of Halle Bailey recording part of your world, and I love seeing this look behind the scenes. Anyway, that's all for today. Like this video if you liked it, and please subscribe. It would mean so much to me. Bye now and have a magical day.